Hello and welcome everyone to the walk around video here at Your Next Car, the 2019 69 Reg G20 330e E-Drive M Sport. The vehicle is presented in mineral grey and of course also features a full wine seat body enhancement package. So as I show you around the vehicle, I will also give you some facts and figures around the E-Drive capabilities of this wonderful car. At the front of the vehicle, you will see the very sharp LED headlights that you'll find on the G23 series. Also down the side, we've further enhanced the look of the vehicle with the brand new 19 inch M performance style alloy wheels. Beginning with a few features of, of course, about charging the car, you'll see the charging port here on the front wing. Really easy, pop that open and that is where you'll charge your vehicle up. Now there are a multitude of ways to do this. Of course, there is a supplied charging cable, which we'll show you in a moment. Now, of course, on a standard three pin socket, it can take around about three to four hours to fully charge the vehicle from stone dead flat. On a full charge, BMW give you around about a 37 mile range of pure electric drive. Now, of course, that will vary on quite a few factors. So that is driving style, driving conditions. So that includes weather and of course, traffic. And of course, what also what accessories you have switched on in the car, which is something I'm going to show you in a bit more depth shortly. The interior is a black Venenskia leather, which in the front seats are heated as well as the electric lumbar option. In the back, there's a three seat Isofix rear bench, central folding armrest. And despite there being a huge amount of batteries and a central mounted electric motor, you would know no different as it is still extremely spacious just as spacious as a regular petrol or diesel equivalent three series. Round the back is the three dimensional rear lights. So of course, we've gone for the gloss black rear boot spoiler and the matching rear diffuser. Now, if, no, if I open up the boot, this is where we'll find our, of course, our charging cable supplied here. We have lost a slight bit of boot depth, no difference to the boot room, just a little bit of depth to, of course, accompany and give room to our batteries. This does drop down, as you can see, so there's still some storage there as well. As I mentioned, the cable is supplied in this little packet. Now, with that 37 mile of pure electric drive, of course, you can choose whether you want pure electric or you would like hybrid. So you would like the assistance from the two litre turbocharged petrol engine. Or, of course, you can choose to save all of your electric for a time that, that suits yourself better i forgot to mention there is also split folding seats now as standard on the g20s inside we've got a live the all new live cockpit if you've not yet seen that that is something that's really exciting it's a really nice thing to look at and gives you a huge amount of information while still giving you everything that you would need to look at 15,000 miles just over just covered sorry about the radio let's get that turned down so the car's now started and again that is something that does take a little bit of getting used to having no sound when you initially turn your car on over here we've got our touchscreen professional wide navigation and media screen and we'll begin with showing you off the capabilities of having touchscreen so as you can see it's really quick really effortless it works exactly like your smartphone device so you can pinch zoom you can even tap in and set destinations to that point that you've pinched upon in terms of the modes for the hybrid slash petrol engine as you can see you've got three separate modes pure electric hybrid and sport sport's the one i really like to show off because you get this thing called extra boost and if you don't like the word extra boost on your car who doesn't like that everybody should what extra boost does is it combines the full electric power from the batteries and the motor and the two litre turbocharged petrol engine up front to give this car its full go which is actually just over just over 300 brake horsepower which is absolutely phenomenal with that extra boost facility turned on in terms of the vehicle for its servicing requirements pre-delivery inspection service its first service isn't due for 4700 miles We've also got Apple CarPlay on this vehicle, as you can see there, as well as all the regular Bluetooth audio and Bluetooth telephone, of course. Wide array of multimedia inputs, including Spotify. And you've got USB line in as well. You can flick through all of this, much like, a uh, again, a smartphone device. It's all customizable. Reverse camera as well, as you can see there. So there is a look around at this fantastic G20 330e. And again, that is just some of the technology and some of the capabilities of this wonderful looking vehicle and a wonderful driving car. I highly rate these vehicles. In fact, they are the now they have won What Cars 2020 
hybrid of the year as well so that is a nice accolade to have on them there is a look around at this this particular one and it is a magnificent looking one as well thanks for watching guys do of course take care and we shall hopefully see you soon take care bye bye